Hey folks, got my F-22 today. Another super looking airplane from Nitroplanes and I get to test this and, and fly it. Uh, this is the, uh, the box it comes in. And I just thought I'd give you a show. Again, this is a, an airplane. It is not for an inexperienced flyer. Um, if you're going to learn to fly on this, you need an instructor. I mean, you wouldn't jump in a real airplane or helicopter at the airport and think you could figure it out on your own, would you? Hey, I'll just figure it out as we go. <laughs> it won't live long. So get some help if you haven't got anything uh, going with this. This is a great looking kit. And uh, I'm going to assemble it here pretty soon. And we're going to see how it flies. It's just an awesome looking unit. Okay, 9 o'clock. We're going to start the F-22 jet right now. Let's see how long it takes us. Okay, here we go. Okay, here's what came out of the box. All the hardware, wheels, linkages, and I've laid the parts out. Kind of stuck them together there so you can see what this is going to look like. I'm going to use my handy dandy electric glue gun and I'm going to put this baby together. But so far, it looks really great. Remember, when you're putting this together, don't over torque this just enough to uh, compress it. You don't want to compress these two screws uh, too far. And uh, you only need two screws on here. Remember that. This uh, this wheel looks like it. We have a problem with that, folks. Uh, darn it! I don't know how I'm going to be able to fix that. It looks like this bird's only going to have uh, one wheel. The rubber is absolutely split. That's a bummer. Do the same thing on the wing. Make sure when you put these screws in that you don't over torque them too far down just enough so that you compress this just like that and as before we've got to drill out the hole on the servo arm so the rod will fit so make sure you put the rods on and the linkages line up the servos first so the linkages are all uh, straight and uh, do this on the wings first and then that way uh, you won't have to mess around too much with it when it's on the plane uh, once you glue them on. Next thing you want to do is go ahead and screw on the landing gear uh, straps on the main body make sure you get this all the way in Okay, got the landing gear on. Uh, nose wheel is going to be tightened down here. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this wheel yet. Okay, next, I'm going to use electric glue again. I've glued the wings on. These go in right here. So I'm just going to pop the electric glue in there. And uh, those, those hook on just like that. Be pretty easy. Here we go. The next thing you want to make sure you do is pull this antenna out of here. It's coiled up. It's under this little flap. You should be able to reach it. Make sure everything's plugged into your receiver and we'll string this antenna out the back of the plane and around so it doesn't back over itself but it's at its full length. Okay, I've strung my antenna out. I've used 100 mile an hour tape on here uh, because it's the only thing that really matches. Uh, you won't see it on the bottom anyway, but you want to get your antenna strung out so I've run it out here like this. Just want to keep it broke up. Okay, my mix switch was turned on. So all of the controls are working at once, so you want to make sure that that's set up right. And now uh, I've got plenty of throwback here, ailerons working good. Put the amazing group on both sides of these things, you don't want this, these to come off or come loose in flight. They're using stiffer wires here, so this actually is better. So uh, the only thing I need now is to wait for the glue to dry on this landing gear and put that on and we're ready to go. Oh, 
elevator, aileron, and we have nose wheel steering up there on the front, and we've got, <gasps> and this baby wants to fly. Let's go fly it. Okay, got her all done. Hour and a half. This is with fixing the tires and uh, doing some other things, but she's all done. So about an hour and a half it takes, and uh, I took my time, but still I wanted to make sure everything was right. And of course, I definitely had to get that canopy with the pilot in it. Okay folks, maiden flight today. Again, it's always windy out here. It's kind of an angled flight, so I'm gonna try and do it. This is the F-22, and uh, this is the maiden flight. So, here we go. <laughs> you ought to come over here or
I'm cold already. <laughs> RC. Nice flyer, huh? Cranks. Really cranks.